I need to add more wood in the fire. No. Impossible. That one is loose. That should fit pretty much anywhere on the stove. That should fit pretty much anywhere on the stove. Better try another one. Hmm. Looks all good to me. It's not enough. I need to feed the fire more. There are still customers on the terrace. I'd better go and see if they would like to order. Those paintings. I think Herr Gustav wanted me to help him choose the one he should buy. He must have left me a note somewhere. Hmm, I should take a closer look at those paintings before choosing one. I think I'll pick this one. So glad Herr Gustav likes me to play for the clients. This way at least I won't get rusty.
Leon, dear, do make an effort. Lenny? Crikey! You nearly had me jump out of my skin. What have you got there? Oh, it's a... it's a camera lens, that's all. A camera lens? It doesn't belong to you, though, does it, Lenny? Lenny? Didn't say it did. It's Frau Junta's, if you want to know. Who is this Frau Junta, anyway? Ginger Junta, over there. She married? Oh no, too old to marry now. She's way past 20, you know. That's why she likes filming Leon. Because he's young and handsome. Lenny! And she never lets me have a go of her gear anyway. I only wanted to help her film something. I bet she's jealous. Lenny, what's so special about Frau Junta's equipment that makes you want to steal it? Borrow it. All right, borrow it. Can't you see? Who would be interested in Ginger Junta if she didn't have a camera, huh? She's too old for Leon. She uses it so she can be the center of attention, you know. Is that what you want? No, not exactly. Besides, there's nothing to do here. I do understand, Lenny, but... No, you don't. Feels like a prison here sometimes, all on my own. When I grow up, I live at the top of a building in the big city, and I'll have a swimming pool on my roof. Believe me, I do understand, Lenny. Because of my coughing fits, I've sometimes had to stay in my room for weeks on end. Imagine that, nothing to see but the same four walls. Oh, right. Must have been pretty tough, I guess. That's why I took up the piano. Do you like doing anything special, Lenny? I suppose... I like making stuff with Papa. He's got ever such clever hands, you know. But he's always so busy in the summer. Let's be friends then, shall we? You won't tell on me then? Not now that we're friends. You promise? I promise. There, like that. Try not to move now, darling. I... I really like talking with you, you know. Woman to woman. Makes a change from that Yunta and all the men. Another creation of Herr Gustav. I guess he won't mind if I take a quick look. The Silberspiegel. The heart-shaped rock face that gave its name to the refuge. According to Herr Gustav, only the most seasoned alpinists can climb it. Madonna laces. Hmm.
the highest peak in the region. Little Lenny said that it's the keeper of the border with Switzerland, and that it's supposed to feed on the souls of those who have been swept away by the mountain. This path leads to Switzerland. One needs to be guided by an alpinist to go through it, though. The Devil Pass starts here. The end of the road for an inexperienced hiker like me, I guess. A bit more to the side, darling, please. Better not interrupt them. That Frau Junta wasn't exactly friendly earlier with Lenny. I'd better not disturb them. I don't want to risk another scolding. Perfectly dry. I think Herr Gustav would not like it if I left the refuge during the service, so I had better stick around. So glad Herr Gustav likes me to play for the clients. This way at least I won't get rusty. That should be it for the fire, but I think there's something wrong with the airflow.
Hmm. Looks all good to me. No. Impossible. Hmm. Looks all good to me. Better try another one. Hmm. Looks all good to me. According to the dials on the stove, there's a problem with the air intake. I'll need to adjust it directly using the stove valves. Better try another one. According to the dials on the stove, there's a problem with the air intake. I'll need to adjust it directly using the stove valves. That should fit pretty much anywhere on the stove. Wow, I've never seen a stove like this. It must be one of Herr Gustav's inventions that everyone talks about down in Wagen. This mechanism controls the air intake, if I remember correctly. Herr Gustav didn't have time to fix it. That's it. I'm done here. I've done all that Herr Gustav told me to do. I'd better go and tell him.